Youth full of vibe is contagious Look in your eyes, feel it's dangerous Grateful I had all the patience I know you going through some change What's up YouTube? I know I'm looking a little bit raggedy But it's okay, we about to fix that But y'all, what I'm gonna be using to do my bantu knots Is just this I don't know, I'm just gonna show it to y'all Cause I'll probably say this all wrong Y'all, my roots is so naughty. Like, my roots real naughty. But I never really part these like straight. It don't really matter how you part it. Ooh. Ooh, we might not be able to do this. Y'all, that probably sound like uh, somebody biting an apple. But I don't take much because I don't want my hair to revert. I just want my hair to get this little moisture in. I'm making sure I get it at the root the most because y'all just saw how my roots were just crunchy like that. They just sound crunchy. So we're going to make sure these roots got a lot of moisture on it. We want that to be the smoothest part because we already know the straight part going to be smooth. We want to get the little crunchy part. We want to make sure that's doing good. Right, it sounds a little bit better. I don't know if y'all can see this one. Make sure y'all can see. So after a while, it'll start like it'll start kind of like twisting on its own. So once it starts twisting on its own, that's how you will know which way you want to wrap it around. But I just start wrapping it around my finger. And that's my first day to nut. And you don't want to put too, too much on it. You just really want to put just enough on it to where it's a moisturized and to where it'll like, you know how you got to like put some products in your hair for it to actually take. Uh, another thing I wanted to mention. Like, you know, sometimes when you twisting it, I really like putting the the hair underneath, underneath the knot, because I feel like, you know, like it'll make it like crinkle, 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 crinkle. I don't know if you can kind of see what I'm trying to say, but okay, let me show you an example. So if I do it and I like, just want to leave it like right here, Sometimes I feel like because it's still like wide, that'll give you like a wider curl. But if I go and I pull it and I, you know, put it like underneath, it kind of makes like the wrapping, instead of it being wrapped like this, it's kind of like wrapped like this, a little like tighter. So I just feel like, you know, just based off whatever type of crinkle and curl you want, think about that when you're doing it. Whew. Hallelujah. Let's just see. <laughs> it probably so funny right now. <laughs> so I am done. What I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna go in and I'm gonna take this Arganol. Ooh, this y'all, this feels good. You wanna know what's next? <laughs> Some plastic wrap. 
I put the plastic wrap on my hair before I go to bed at night. And what I do, I wouldn't, I would don't think I would do this if um if my hair is like in its natural state and like wet. But I do this just to put a little bit of moisture into the hair. I don't want my hair to sweat. I don't want it to be super, super wet. Like I don't want it to be drenching wet. But I put this on and then I'ma just take it off and then give my time give my hair time to actually air dry a little bit and i don't put on a lot because again like i said i don't want my hair to just like sweat during, throughout the night i just wanted to get a little bit of moisture to it this is totally up to you you don't have to do this i just like doing this okay so y'all i'm just gonna go to bed and i will see y'all in the morning good morning y'all it is the next morning um uh, okay, so y'all know I went to sleep. Um, I had the aluminum foil. I mean, not the aluminum foil. I had the plastic wrap on my hair. I actually didn't sleep with it. I usually do, but the only reason why I didn't sleep with it is because I was going to be up a little later last night doing some work. So I had it all on my head for, I think, like an hour maybe, or maybe not even that long, like 45 minutes or so, just until I felt that my hair was a little moist. And then I took the wrap off and then I just went to sleep with my bunnet on. So I'm just gonna go ahead and just take all the bobby pins out my head. And y'all, <clears throat> I was watching the video I recorded last night and I was just trying to make sure I touch on stuff that I saw in the video. But I did see how I had a little more like of the residue left in my head. So I went back in and rub that out smooth that out you don't want any of that residue just sitting up there you want to try to smooth it out because like i said before if i said it you don't want it to dry in your head because sometimes it can dry and just go away and then sometimes it'll dry and like flake up and you don't really want it to be flaky i'm really nervous about taking my hair loose because i went outside this morning and it's misty and Y'all, I'm not even lying. I will put on a bunny in a minute, like, to go outside, to go where I need to go. Like, I gotta, <laughs> I gotta go to my class, but I ain't even lying. While I'm outside, I'll throw my bunny on until I get inside the building. Cause this was, you not about to mess up my bantu nights. My little style, I worked so hard for. And I'm just gonna like unscrew my hair. Like basically just unscrew it the opposite way that it was screwed. And then I kind of just find the tail, the end of it. And I just go and I unravel, unravel it. Look at that. Ooh, I'm excited. See how this is about to come out. But I'm just going to take these pieces and I'm just going to stretch them across my head. And I just do this to get some length to it. And I try not to like take it all the way to my ends because I don't want my ends to be um, straight. This is why I love YouTube, y'all. YouTube, show, YouTube shows the behind the scenes like... You know, everybody else just see like, oh, the how it came out. Now nah, YouTube show it all. It show the behind the scenes what you looking like. Like we look like this before we look like you know, popping. All right, and you don't have to keep this in long. I'm just doing this for a little while. So probably for like ten minutes, seven, eight minutes. That's probably as long as I'ma have it like this. All right, y'all. So I think I did that for about a good. It was probably like eight minutes or 10 minutes. What I forgot to tell y'all. Oh, I was also looking at the video last night that I was recording. I was kind of started editing already. And y'all, I forgot to say, I don't know if y'all noticed, but my eye is kind of black. The eye that, had, I, the eye that I said had the style on it, it's kind of black. I had used this ointment on it. Okay, so I got the style from like a clogged eyelash follicle. Like something had got stuck um 
on the eyelash follicle and it kind of like clogged it and that's what happened that's how i got the stuff but i was using this ointment and basically the ointment started turning like my eye black that's what the doctor lady said i'm just going through all type of stuff right now with my eye so irritating Ooh. Take a little more drop of that oil just because I don't know if y'all can tell, but I like my dome to be juicy, juicy. So I'm just gonna go in and kind of like softly unravel it. Like kind of, kind of twisting it the opposite way that it already is until I get to the ends. And then just kind of breaking it apart and rolling it around my fingers just to put like a little bit more of that curl back into it. Yeah, I don't never really do much with my edges just because I really just haven't figured out how to do my edges perfectly yet. Okay, so y'all, what I just did was I just went into like my bathroom mirror a little bit just to see it a little up closer so I can um, fluff. I just fluffed and spread it out my hair a little bit more. This, <laughs> this is like this because this side is shorter than this side. So only thing I'm doing here is I'm just, I just like kind of did like the banded method a little bit on this little area just because I want to stretch it to get it a little longer just so it can match this side. Y'all, this is my final look. I love this. I think it's just so cute. It's so light. It's fluffy. It's like really bouncy and stuff. It smells good. <laughs> it smells real good. I really like this style. y'all comment down below what else y'all want to see any type of hairstyles y'all want to see anything y'all want to try anything y'all haven't even seen before but you thinking like oh this might be kind of cute leave it down in the comment section because i would love to see i would love to try anything that y'all want me to try i want to even find new stuff to try so y'all may put me on something new if you like this look please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel to be a part of the family i would love to embrace you with open arms <laughs> and ring my notification bell to be notified when i post new videos i'll see y'all in my next one bye Hit back. you feel the vibe is contagious look in your eyes it is dangerous grateful i had all the patience